Seven years ago, Jessie Schulter wanted to do it in her hair and help people diagnosed with cancer. But unable to find a resource, she started Cut for the Cause and has donated her hair ever since. The primary focus of the uh, event, of course, is to do the hair cutting and send it off for the wigs programs. All of that, again, stays here at the local YRMC Center. After the hair is cut, it's put into plastic bags and mailed off and made into wigs for cancer patients to use. Shelter says hair donating to Cut for the Cause offers those going through cancer a gift. And she shares the true meaning behind that gift. To help them have a sense of maybe who they were before this deadly disease entered their lives. Um, I don't feel for a lot of people that it's more about vanity as much as just having a sense of themselves. Volunteer hairstylists like Kimberly Hernandez seem to have that same passion. It's very heartwarming. I've done it um, before for uh, Locks of Love and uh, I saw it on Facebook and I just thought I'd donate my time. Over 31 people donated their hair just like Priscilla Delgado who has donated three times and this year she donated over 12 inches. It grows out every two years and I just want to do it so I can help people. 